How's it going guys? My name's Neil Beale and I'm finally back with another Hitman video. So today it's the first video of uh, Sapienza. I've been playing it for a, a good few hours now and I'm really really enjoying it. I kind of stopped publishing to YouTube for a little bit, actually quite a long time because I was getting a little bored of Paris. I really played it and played it and played it and it's ran it into on. the ground pretty much. So I took a break um, and I'm glad to be back and I'm absolutely loving this uh, Sapienza level. I feel it's there are much more things to do and um, the objectives and the challenges are I just think they're they're more entertaining. So today I'm going to show you one of the funniest I think of this episode the cannabis joint one. So I found this completely by accident I, when I ran into this bohemian uh, pad I, and I found a cannabis joint. I had no idea what to do with it But today I'm going to show you so you can actually give it to the targets But as you can see I've made my way to the top of the um, Of the tower with the clock on it. So it's kind of above the ice cream shop And you will uh, find yourself in this kind of stoner's pad um, Take this guy out because he will see you and he will kick up a fuss so it's easy just to subdue him on this table you'll find the join. You can actually take that uh, outfit, the bohemian outfit, but where we're going we will not be able to get in. So it's best if you prepare beforehand and take the outfit of uh, Oscar Lafayette, that's his name, the psychologist, because you can pretty much have access to the whole mansion, which is nice. So make your way to the mansion. Uh, we're going to go inside. Don't talk to the butler, don't worry about that. It doesn't matter if you do, but it just we don't need that. We're not going to go for that doctor. objective today. Hello, doc. So, walk straight past the butler and then we're going to go upstairs. Easy if you just go on the, the right hand side. And then turn right again and we're going to go up the next set of stairs. Hi, doctor. And then you'll see it's the first door on your left. And this is the room that uh, Sylvia often walks into. So when we're inside, you will see these boxes. And there's a pair of scissors. Next to the pair of scissors is a pack of cigarettes. And you can uh, choose to place the joint inside. So do that. Nobody gets suspicious or anything. Nobody can really see what you're doing. Um, she is close by, but we're going to have to wait for a little bit. So I'll speed it up. Okay, what I did was made sure I was next to an exit, because as soon as she so falls to the ground, people would, for some reason, get suspicious of you, so you it's best to just stay near an exit. But it's good to watch, you've got to watch. All work and no play, huh? I have never really understood the distinction. Touché. Be careful, though. Roberto's every bit the stud. You should have seen the girl. Come in! That's it. The wobble, wobble, and she fell, so... That's the first one. I'm going to show you how you can use this on the male target. I forgot his name. It's just standard procedure. We're all friends here. So, this time we're going to make our way to the back garden where he plays golf. And I was dressed as Oscar because I thought he had access to the the back, but he doesn't. I got found trespassing, and I quickly exited, and they were fine. What you want to do then, in that case, is wait to the guard, wait for the guards to turn around, unlock this door, and inside um, there's an outfit, like a mansion staff, I believe. Looks basically the same as the auction staff from Paris. Um, but yeah, put this on, and you're uh, allowed access to the to the backyard. So we're going to make our way round to the right, the right side of the mansion. Yep, all good. No, uh, no suspicions. So all the way to the right, and then there's a fireplace, you'll see. And to the right of the fireplace is the another cigarette pack. This time, I'm going to put it in there. I believe there is a joint you can find in the ruins next to the mansion. I did hear that. Somebody said there was a a join in the ruins, but I've not actually had a look yet, so I did this on a separate that run. Is Silvio Caruso. It's not a problem. 
So here I had to be a little sneaky because again they will be suspicious if you stand close, if people can see you standing close. And we had a much better view of this one. There we go. Easy as that. And yeah, we've just unlocked two challenges. So that's it. If you enjoyed the video, if you found it helpful, please give me a like and I'll see you soon.